Welcome to One Minute Kizkit, where every week we answer your questions and share Kizkit tips and tricks. This week, the question is... What is Kizkit's barrier operation? You may have come across the barrier operation in Kizkit. We can add a barrier to a circuit using the barrier method. But what does this do? While you will sometimes see the barrier used as a visual tool to separate parts of a circuit, Kizkit's barrier is really an instruction for the transpiler. The transpiler uses certain optimizations to improve the performance of your circuits. For example, you'll remember that two adjacent H gates should have the same effect as no operation. If we transpile and draw this circuit, we can see the transpiler has removed these two gates to achieve the same computation using less operations. This is great, but sometimes we want to keep these operations. Maybe we want to see how the hardware handles these two gates. We can place a barrier between these two H gates to stop the transpiler from cancelling them out. When we draw this circuit, we can see that the gates have been transpiled into the native gates available on the Armonk chip, but there are still two gates being applied. The difference between using the barrier operation and setting the optimization level parameter is that the transpiler will still perform optimizations on either side of the barrier. For example, we can see here that the two H gates on the left have been removed since they have no effect, and the two gates on the right have been collapsed into a single operation. If you have a question you want answered, then please leave it in the comments. And if you found this video useful, you can subscribe for more 1 Minute Kizkit every Monday, as well as other Quantum and Kizkit related videos. Thanks for watching and goodbye.